everyone welcome back to the channel in this video we are in Nakusa on the Wisconsin River targeting pole spawn walleyes it was a windy rainy day blustery winds like 30 mile an hour but we did get into some fish we got some really nice fish in this video for you so stick around I hope you enjoy this video and stay tuned for more content oh no he ain't big enough yeah that's okay <laughs> yeah, he's a dink. <laughs> yeah, see ya. <laughs> Thanks. All right, first fish just talking to a subscriber here. The current just smoked that plastic. fish what is it sheephead no it's a walleye get that on that gold paddle tail yeah. hold on hold on mm -hmm. oh. come on hey get your get your here Okay, that's our first fish on the black paddle tail. Going back. Okay, we're sitting on the edge of the river channel here. Um, we're probably in like three, four foot of water. These fish are pushed up. The flow is up quite a bit and the fish are pushed up to the side here. So we're just casting um, behind the boat and dragging quarter ounce jig with a twister tail, liquid bullet cat, savage saucy swimmer. Jackson would say and we're just kind of pumping it along I'll show you how we're doing this here in a little bit here I'm hooked up no no Matt. no 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 it's okay it's a little guy it's so hard to tell in a current like this when he does his head shakes I can tell how big he is And the jig's out. <laughs> he thumped it too. That's like a 14 incher. Little guy. Little 14 incher maybe. Oh no, he's. I'm used to them Green Bay fish. He's 15 and a quarter. So we will keep him because we're keeping fish today. All right, I just got this guy. We're battling like 30 mile an hour winds. Nice little chunker here, 16 incher. Just smoked that purple plastic savage swimmer. It's been a grinder. 30 mile an hour winds. We're hanging in there. The troll motor is working overtime. This nice little Wisconsin River fish. That's number two legal for the day. He just smoked that thing, but. Yeah, I'll see if we can pick a couple more up on the sand flat here. Okay, so what what we are looking for here is anything that diverts the current that breaks it. We're checking this shallow flat. These fish are just pushed up on here, getting ready to spawn. I don't know if there's there's probably some marshy area that they're gonna spawn in. They do like that in rocks, but it just kind of this island breaks the current and that's where we're sitting I'll put a map shot in of that it's really nothing spectacular to look at but it it is something that diverts the current and this area is a little bit warmer water it's almost 42 degrees even with the 30 to 40 mile an hour wind gusts oh man I'm hooked up I'm I'm hooked up now. This is a big, big something, big 
Quebec or something. Oh man, just freaking cranked it. I can't even move this thing. Big cat, big walleye, big walleye. Yeah. Oh man, let's go. Look at it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just smoked it. Smoked this willow cat. I can't even move this thing. Look at it. Mm -hmm. That is a big walleye. <laughs> Look at this one. Wisconsin River Giant. Let's wait. I'll tell you when, just hold on. Okay. Good job. Good job. That is a donkey. Holy smokes. Just smoked that plastic. Ooh, there we go. Oh man, what a pig. <laughs> what a freaking toad, look at this thing. 20, only 26, but what a freaking tank. Look, look at this beast. Man, I knew right immediately it was a good fish. All right, gonna get this fish back. We're sitting in 5.6 feet of water. So check shallow, cause there's some big mamas lurking. Gonna get this girl back. Try to get an underwater pick. Cool underwater release. All right, so as I was saying, you know, don't be afraid to check shallow, even on these inclement weather days. That fish was obviously sitting in probably three feet of water, just destroyed that plastic that Willow Cat Savage Swimmer. I'm just using the eighth ounce jig, and you can see the paint is just worn right off it, and that fish was sitting along this, these down tree lines, probably getting ready to spawn, and just smoked that plastic. I was just hopping it, hopping it along the shoreline. Most of our fish we found super shallow. This is a fun bite that with this right before the spawn, these fish will push up shallow like this. And I'll just put a another map shot in it. It's kind of the same same area, uh, tucked behind an island, something to break the current. They're just kind of pushing up, getting ready to spawn to see if we can get a couple more. Fish on. Oh no. Oh no. That's not as big as the last one. It's little. Well, not little, but it's smaller than the last one. I got smoked the time before and I threw it back. I, I don't think it's that big, but. I never know. I just got smoked. He kind of nipped it before, but I wonder if he's hooked funny. Oh no. This is something hooked funnier. Or it's big. It's big. It's just big. <laughs> I'm like, I can't move this thing. Is that the same fish? I don't know. No way that's the same fish. I better get a measurement just so it kind of looks the same. No. No way. Nope, that one's 22. Just smoked it. 
another big fish on the willow cat plastic I got a mess here All right another one on the willow cat black with purple tail 22 incher another slot fish Wisconsin River fish just smoked that thing again just hopping it on the bottom well I think that's plastics done Nope. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> she bit her right in half yeah other healthy fish good to see these fish in the river like this they're pushing up ready to spawn it is a horrible day for fishing <laughs> weather wise but action wise very good I'm gonna get her back all right so this is what we've been doing we've just been casting it all along the shoreline and just reeling it keeping it right off the bottom and then and then uh you know like keep it right off the bottom and then give it a little pop and let it let it fall and it seems like after you give it the pop is when they hit it those last two bigger fish came that way and even the legals and the smaller fish have came that way so that's just rolling along with this carbon x1000 like a medium fast action rod yeah it works great this Kate Outdoors medium extra fast tip is great for this this kind of fishing that's gonna do it for a little trip on a very rainy Sunday afternoon got a couple slot fish a couple legals with a good time super windy but don't be afraid to check shallow using plastics um, live bait isn't your only option this time here these fish are getting ready to spawn so appreciate everyone for watching if you're not please subscribe and stay tuned for our next video